I've been fascinated with animal communication for a long time. And if you are like me as a child, you were fascinated with the idea of animals talking and animals talking to humans. And so people tried with great apes for a long time to teach them sign language and to teach them uh, symbols. And yet the jury is out there to what degree other animals can learn any symbols, anything that would resemble a word and being able to actually use it productively, communicate. And given what we know about dogs and dogs being able to uh, understand human communication and be more motivated to interact with humans than any other animal out there, we thought this would be a unique opportunity to try this out and see whether actually we could A, show that dogs can learn symbols uh, and by using symbols, maybe they can communicate about things we didn't know they could even think about. And so what is in their mind? And beyond that, we hope that this could also tell us something about um, what they need and how they're dealing with the environment they live in. Um, so what we did is we introduced them uh, to what could be the equivalent of a keyboard. So there's a soundboard, there's buttons, you can record your, your voice on it, in particular words. And then when you press the button, you can hear uh, those words. And it will be something like, go outside, and you basically tell that you want to go outside, or like, want food, and you like, you ask for food. And so what we are seeing is not only that they seem to be able to learn to associate the sound to the action or the meaning associated with it, but some of them, just like children do at age two, when they have a, about a repertoire of about 50 words, is they seem to be combining some of these buttons in what seems to be potentially the equivalent of combining symbols and meanings into sentences. And so while the jury is still out there about whether that's what's happening, we are noticing this ability to kind of communicate more than just like food, outside, play, uh, mom, and so on. 